Hi YouTubers, what's going on? Just want to apologize. We get the bad with the good. You get the good running videos, you get the bad running videos. First issue that I have is we need to find somewhere else to bash, man. Soccer fields are boring and we need to do better than that for sure. Um, as you can see, I put all my stuff in, all my lipos went back into storage mode that I use today. So, we, um, alright, so we had some issues today and probably had something to do with the tuning ability on the LRP. Um, my clutch bell bearing went bad and I think the reason it went bad is yes you can you can put your clutch on and your bell on and if you don't have enough play a little bit of play it's gonna swell up you're gonna damage the bearing and you're gonna have issues you're gonna have issues tuning also on the other hand if your bell is too loose then you're gonna have issues with um, you know, you're going to strip out your bell and you're going to strip out your spur gear. Which is exactly what happened today, guys. I stripped out my spur gear and my bell. And I knew it was a little bit loose, but I didn't think it would be that big of a deal. But I'm here to tell you guys, you got to get those bells just right or you're going to have issues. So we destroyed, I had noticed a clicking noise in there and I was like, what the hell is that? Thought it was my diffs, but it was not. And that was part of the issue of the LRP running really crappy there towards the end. Uh, destroyed my bell and destroyed my spur gear. So you got it, but lucky for me, I have a brand new spur gear and I have tons of bells so bells aren't an issue uh, but if you look on this one now I've already redone it we have uh, it's just a tiny bit of play in there guys I don't know if y'all can see that or not but A little bit of play in that bell. So make sure you get it just right, guys. Shim it up right so you don't have these issues like I had today. Um, not only did we have uh, a catastrophic failure in the techno today, and I, you know, I just had all this out the other day um, redoing the diffs, but. We will uh, we'll get her put back together. Um, I might as well go ahead and clean this out as well and, and refill it with uh, 100K. And um, also, we will um, 100K. All I use is TLR, uh, diff fluids, and shock oils. So we'll go ahead and get that done. Um, Man, it just sucks, guys, but this is where the patience, I was talking about patience in, in 1.8 scale nitro. If you don't have patience, move on to electric because patience is is a virtue, people. You, you got to have it. Um, I'm still running the regular switch on here. This is a... Uh, uh, spectrum switch it's good and tight so I'm not running a high voltage servos on here yet although I have ordered them this is my list of goodies that, that I'm ordering uh, tomorrow after work we're gonna get some more CTO 6 plugs we're gonna get some LRP plugs I'll probably buy two of each of those I don't need them right now but it's always good to have them uh, I already ordered two of the Savox high voltage servos, so I'm going to order two more. And we're going to get uh, four more quarts, another gallon of Bones Brew. Um, and also we're going to get uh, another set of Max Life shoes. Because I have 
a brand new low C clutch right here. If you guys are wondering uh, about the four shoe low C clutch, it comes with the collet and everything you need. Uh, it's LOS A9105 flywheel and collet aluminum. It's for the 8B, but it's for the all all the 8 series uh, truggies and buggies. Now you can get uh, that is an aluminum, a lightened aluminum one. Um, the one for the 8X is a good one as well, but it's a little more expensive. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get all this back together. Just remember guys, make sure that your gear mesh is good uh, so you don't have issues like this. I'm just lucky to have another one here. And it's been, guys, it's been three years or more since I've stripped a spur gear. But I have done it before, guys. This is the the MBX5 spur gear. Uh, we're just waiting on a new diff, diff cup. Uh, I have this diff cup. I could use this one, but it's not a high uh, a high content. Where it'll hold a little bit more uh, diff fluid. Um, so I'm going to wait on on the proper diff cup on that. Then we'll get all this going back together. So two high high voltage servos will be going in here. And then the other two high voltage servos will go in the 8T. And once I do that, I'll, I have another Sky RC and I have a ProTech RC, uh, those button switches with the uh, voltage, low voltage cutoff on them. So I wanted to run this today, but I was just kind of depressed with that shitty run on the Techno. And uh, I had another run. I hit the camera, the GoPro again, and really smashed it. But I accidentally deleted it. I wanted to show you all. That one was pretty cool. Uh, well, it's not cool to hit the GoPro, but just seeing it on video was freaking awesome. Everything went kaboom. But um, I think I can use these same gaskets on the Techno. I'll check them out. There's 10 of them in there. Uh, $8.99 if you have the Mugen MBX5. Uh, I think it's pretty much for all the MBX and the MGTs. Uh, part number 0257 comes with 10 of them for nine bucks all right guys we're gonna go ahead and get all this back together it's uh, 7 30 p.m. Uh, I'm gonna watch a few videos Rajah's got something up there I want to see uh, the muggy's got a new running video with one of his new whips looks like that's uh, Star Wars body or whatever I don't seek the muggy out to watch him, but but I'll check it out because it pops up, uh, uh, you know that that it was uh, a video that I would be interested in. And when it does that, I'll go ahead and watch it. I mean, I ain't got nothing against the muggy man. He's just a real asshole. Uh, I tried to reach out to the guy wholeheartedly and uh, put the past behind us, and uh, for some reason he thinks I'm subliminally putting in my uh videos uh cutting them down or whatever but my my sincere uh olive branch was extended to the muggy and he decided to shit all over that so fuck that dude excuse my language i'm sorry tyler close your ears but if someone can't see when someone is trying to extend an olive branch or trying to make amends with somebody and they still want to treat you like shit then that person just obviously uh, hates your guts and that's cool I'm not going to lose sleep over that uh, but I will tell you guys the muggy is intelligent whether he learned it on his own or someone else you know it came from someone else he does a lot of research uh, the muggy is 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 schooled in 1-8 scale nitro so I'm not going to say you guys not to watch that guy uh, he does have some good information to put out there. And I will once again, Muggy, if I know you're going to watch this. I have no hard feelings. I don't appreciate you coming back on it like the way that you did. But, you know, I'm here for you if you ever need me, bro. 100%. So we'll go ahead and get out of here so I can get this spur gear put back on so we can get the techno up and running again. Other than that, guys, remember, treat people the way that you want to be treated. And um, we'll see you guys later.